What up, guys? I hope everybody's doing well out there. What I want to talk about today is the narcissist rabbit hole. So if you're one of those people that constantly watches narcissist videos on YouTube, this video is for you. Now, if you watch these videos constantly, there's a really good chance that you are dating a narcissist, you're in a relationship or a marriage with a narcissist, maybe you work with a narcissist, maybe you have a family member that's a narcissist, and you're watching these videos because you find them relatable. And what these videos do to you and what these content creators do to you is they enable your abuser by justifying it in your own head. You think, well, if so many other people are going through the same thing that I'm going through, then it must be normal. Therefore, you stay in the situation and you continue watching the videos over and over again without ever removing yourself from the situation. If you are in a relationship with a narcissist, if you are constantly being exposed to somebody with narcissistic personality disorder, you need to remove yourself from the situation or keep your distance as much as possible. Stop sitting around and taking the abuse and justifying it. It's okay to go through it once or twice. We've all been through it. I've been through it. I'm sure you've been through it. But here's the thing. After you go through it once or twice, you're not supposed to go back to it. You're supposed to learn how to vet people. You're supposed to get a little bit of game. Be smart. Be a little bit savvy. When you see somebody is love bombing you, keep your distance. Remind yourself that you've seen this before. You've been here before. How's the cycle go? Love bombing, devaluing, discarding, hoovering, going through the cycle over and over again. Well, if you're constantly going through this cycle more than once, more than twice, you're the problem. And the time is now to stop watching these videos. Stop allowing yourself to be a doormat. Stop going through this cycle over and over again, because watching these videos is just as addictive as actually being abused by the narcissist, the trauma bond. You're trauma bonded to the videos the same way that you're trauma bonded to the narcissist. It's time to start treating yourself like you're somebody that you care about. If you had a pet dog, if you have a child and they're sick, You'll treat them with care. You'll treat them like you want them to get better. It's time to treat yourself the same way. Stop watching the bullshit. Stop cramming your mind with that toxic bullshit. You're addicted to it. You need to get out. If you go through it once, so be it. But if you go through it twice, it's your fault. Get out. And when you get out, stay out. Because if you allow them back after you got out once, they'll be back. But this time, they'll want revenge.